everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from Santa Anita Park on Sunday, February the 19th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle Southern California race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 this afternoon, folks, 3.36 p.m. Pacific post time. This is the San Vicente Stakes, 7 furlong sprint on the dirt, grade 2, 3-year-olds, race for $150,000. Contenders number two, Creative Cause, number four, Smoking G, number five, American Act, and number one, Let's Get Kraken. Number two, Creative Cause, takes a five-level class drop, which should negate a 105-day layoff to enter the stakes field. The overall speed leader in this field, sprinting at today's specialized distance of seven furlongs on the dirt, has hit the board in power run fashion in five straight, winning three times in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jockey Joel Rosario has been in his irons on two previous occasions, posting a win and a show result. He's back today for his third ride, gunning for another circle trip. The 8-1 to one shot to perform smoke and G comes off a power run win in his last start. His nice early speed abilities to complement for this sprint. Race 7 summary, number 2, Creative Cause, tops my contenders list today, which also includes number 4, Smoking G, number 5, American Act, and number 1, Let's Get Kraken, 2451 on the 7th from Santa Anita, the $150,000 Grade 2 San Vicente Stakes. Bonus Long Shots, Parks Racing. Race 5, number 9, Taylor Island, an 8 to 1 shot, drops in class by 5 track master units. Nice overall speed for this 6.5 furlong sprint. Louisiana Downs, race 4, the 12 to 1 bomb, number 10, Bad Oak Special, a track master plus power pony qualifier. Takes a 6 level class drop, the overall speed leader in this maiden field today. So handicapping from Santa Anita on a Sunday, Rick Deedham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.